in this video i'm going to teach you how to make this beautiful emulsified body scrub without further ado let's dive right into the video the first ingredient on my screen is shea butter shea butter is loaded with antioxidants that helps the skin retain moisture and makes it soft and smooth then the next ingredient is mango butter Mango butter has moisturizing and anti-inflammatory properties that soothes the skin and also reduces redness. Then the next ingredient is my emulsifying wax. This allows water-based ingredients and oil-based ingredients to bind together. My next ingredient is almond oil. Almond oil is known for its lightweight moisturizing properties. And the last ingredient is sugar. You know, sugar is an exfoliant that's used in a lot of ways to exfoliate the body, the skin, etc. So I'm just going to move on to the next step. The next step is to combine my body butters together and to combine my emulsifying wax together with my almond oil to prepare them for the next step. Then the next thing to do is to melt the body butter and the wax together. Just melt them in the same temperature. That's why I'm using the same pot to melt them. So we don't have different temperature of ingredients. The method I'm using is called double boiling method. So after melting, I realized my shea butter has this kind of stain in it or dirt. So whenever you want to get to your product, you have to be very careful not to buy dirty products so i have like this sand stuff in my shea butter and i'm just going to get it out before we move on to the next step so after doing that i'm going to transfer my shea butter and mango butter which has been boiled together and also the emulsifying wax with the almond oil together in another bowl that is much bigger than the one I used in boiling them so that we can have more space to to mix our ingredients together you know we just have more space to do our thing after mixing after combining those ingredients together I'm going to place this in the fridge for a while for like five minutes so I just get solid a little bit you don't want it to get too much hard too hard so just get it soft solid a little bit and the next thing i'm going to do is to mix my ingredients together you can also use a spatula if you have um the time but this just makes the process more easy and i'm going to mix 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 and mix just to have a beautiful consistency the consistency i'm looking for you realize whenever you are when you are mixing this it starts to get creamy, the colors start to change, you know, it just starts to have this thick consistency. You can also just let it rest a little bit as you are mixing. Just leave it for like 5 to 10 minutes, then go back to it and keep on mixing. So this is what I have. It is really beautiful. But I'm just going to mix it a little bit so that it can have this fluffy, more fluffy consistency. So after I'm done with that, and I think I'm satisfied with this um, result, I'm going to add in my vitamin E oil. By the way, all the ingredients used and the exact measurements will be at the end of the video. So please make sure you watch till the end so you can make your own beautiful body scrub. And the next ingredient I'll be using is preservative. We need preservative in this recipe, especially if you're going to use this for a long time. You know, as you keep putting your hand in this, your hands might be wet, probably when you are bathing. And when water starts to get into your product, it starts to build mold. Sometimes you can't see it with your eyes. So it's best to use preservative if you have one. And if you don't have, just make sure you use up your ingredients in a short amount of time. Yeah. So after adding the vitamin E oil and the preservative, I'm just going to mix them well so that everything can be well incorporated then the next thing i'm going to do this um this face is actually very optional if you don't have 
I'm going to add in mica powder into the ingredients just to give it the purple color that you saw at the beginning of this video. First of all, I added little at first. This does not require any measurements. You just have to keep adding the color till you know you get what you want. And I realized mm -mm, I don't like the color I'm seeing right now, so I just want to add more purple because I want it to be like deep um color deep in purple color so i'm just going to add in the mica powder and if this is your first time watching my video hi and welcome welcome to z natural care let me just take this minute to welcome you to my channel um i teach how to make safe and effective natural product for the skin for the air and beauty in general I would appreciate if you support my channel by sharing and liking and also leaving a comment in the comment section below. And if you are a returning subscriber, thanks for always coming back to watch my video. I love you so much. One thing about adding color to your product is that you have to mix them well. Mix it well so that you don't have one side that is filled with color and other side that is not, you know, colored at all. Then the next thing I'm going to do is to add in my sugar you can use any type of sugar you want you can use brown sugar granulated sugar or white sugar any type of sugar is fine i'm just going to add in my sugar bit by bit just to be precise with the measurement and also i think the bowl is a little bit small and i want to incorporate everything well so i'm just going to add in my sugar bit by bit and mix 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 so after I'm done with mixing, I'm going to transfer it into any plastic or container I find. This is a DIY. You can use anything you have at home or all those used plastic that you have at home that just lying helplessly somewhere. Just take it and make a use out of those things. So let's talk about this body scrub now. This body scrub, what I love about it is that it doesn't have oily feeling whenever you use it. You know some DIY body scrub, when you use it, it just has this body oily feeling on your skin and you have to wash your body with sponge and soap again after using this this washes off easily and that is because of our secret ingredient which is the emulsifying wax so you would love this product a lot just use it three times in a week just like your other exfoliating product and you're good to go so this is the ingredient exact ingredient used Feel free to screenshot, go back and screenshot it till I see you in my next video. Stay safe, stay happy, and stay healthy. Bye.